Hello friends, I am Raghav and I hope all of you are doing awesome. Today I have some very important updates for you from Cypress. Now we know Cypress latest version has come and it is version 10. And in version 10, there are some changes from the earlier versions. There are changes in the project structure. There are changes in the configuration files. So there are a lot of changes. Now, what you have to do if you want to continue with the latest version. So if I uh, show you, if I take you to Cypress version migration to version 10. So there is a page you can see here from Cypress documentation, the migration guide that if you are already using Cypress earlier to version 10, and now if you want to move to version 10, what are the changes you will have to do? So you can check this. These are the, this is the migration guide. And if you go to my website, that is automationstepbystep.com. And here, if you go to the Cypress playlist, which is here, now here you will see in my Cypress playlist, here you will see there are these earlier videos that I created, which you can see in yellow thumbnail here. And then at the end, you will see these masterclass videos. As of now, I have added four parts and I will add more here. So these four masterclass. Now these uh, masterclass tutorial that I have created, these are on the latest version of Cypress that is version 10 as of now. So if you want to continue with version 10, which is latest as of now, you can watch these. And in case you want to watch these step-by-step -step single videos, these were created earlier to version 10. So it will have the old project structure and you can still use this. So if you want to use, uh, if you want to continue with the version earlier to 10, you can say NPM install when you are installing Cypress, when you go to the step of installation of Cypress, you can use the command NPM install Cypress. And then after this command, you can add at the date symbol and then give the specific version number. So for example, 9.7.0, this I believe was the last uh, version of the nine series. So this command will install that specific version of Cypress and then you can continue using that particular version and then you can follow any of these tutorial. Also, I have added this uh, project structure update video to tell you what is new in version 10. So you can also watch this and coming to uh, Cypress Studio. So again, Cypress Studio is now removed from version 10. If I show you, if I take you to the Cypress Studio documentation, here you will see Cypress Studio has been removed in Cypress version 10 and it will be rethought and revisited in later release. Now Cypress uh, Studio is a very important, is a very uh, useful tool using Cypress Studio. We can very quickly record our test. We can, uh, we can record our actions and create the recorded test scripts automatically. So it was very, very useful and it is not available in version 10 as of now. So again, if you want to continue using Cypress Studio and you want to create your tests by recording, you can still use it by going to the earlier version of Cypress or using any earlier version of Cypress prior to version 10. I have also sent a question to the Cypress team to know about the future of Cypress Studio. Uh, will it be reconsidered? Will it be available in the future releases? As I get any reply from them, I will let you know and I will update on my channel. So since then, if you want, you can use any version of Cypress prior to 10. Or if you want to continue using uh, version 10, you can follow my Cypress masterclass videos. And in that, you will not have Cypress Studio. So this, these were the two important updates on Cypress. And I will keep you updated as I receive any more news on Cypress. I hope this was useful. Thank you for watching.